involved in a four truck spin and crash. There's damage throughout. You see Tyler Ankrum probably got the worst end of it, but Grant Enfinger, that front end of that truck doesn't look too good. You know, we were just talking about the gray that was back in 17th is about where it starts. Tanner Gray gets a bit of a shove from behind. Right in front of the Tide truck. That's the truck that's going to run to the back of Taylor Gray. It's going to turn him into the 16 truck of Tyler Ankerman. He, in turn, catches the 88 of Matt Kraft. And you see Grant with absolutely nowhere to go. He runs into the side of Taylor Gray. You see Kligerman slipping through again in that bright orange truck. Was it the 41 truck? Maybe a Bailey Curry that was behind it's the. It's just, it's so hard to see. Yeah. Yeah, there it is. That's Hold the 41. That. Yep. Bam. Just lost the momentum, momentum off the corner. You can't see that well out the trucks because of the one in front of you, and he just didn't have an idea that they were going to stack up like that. And it's a chain reaction. The, you know, the first truck that sees them slows down, slow down has a good chance at it. The farther back you go, the harder it is. Did Matt Crafton slip through this? No, he has, he has some damage. Damage on the left rear there. He's going to get caught by Ankrum right there as Ankrum comes back across the racetrack. Ankrum's going to make some contact with the inside safer barrier as well. Tom Ajeski with some damage. I thought maybe he got through there unscathed. Great heads up move for him, but obviously some damage to the right front. For Tom Ajeski. Grant Enfinger had qualified mid pack, made up some great gains. He wasn't concerned about starting back there, obviously. Got up 